Okay, our best thing ever show uh, continues with producer Ted. Ted's favorite summer activity is fast paced, it's interactive, and can be quite lucrative. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, if you follow, follow Ted on social media, and I would encourage you to, this comes as no surprise. Here is producer Ted's best thing ever. So my best thing ever takes me down to Shakopee for some good old horse racing. And while a lot of people this might be fun, for me it is a business meeting and we are gonna try and make some money. So picking the horse starts down here and we'll show you as they walk in just what we're looking for. So this first race is about half, half the oval. So six furlongs. You're looking for your horse to get out to an early lead and then hold it. So I need them to be a little jumpy out of the gate. Basically what I'm looking for is a little head bob. Once I see that, I know the horse is ready to go. I also don't bet on the favorites because then you don't make money and what, what fun is that? Um, so we'll see what we got here. He's, ooh, yeah, he's kind of looking around. He does not even know it's race day. So this is what we've gone with. Three dollars. Number four to win. It's also important to basically sit in the exact same spot every single time. Can't mess with the cheat. Cannot mess with the cheat. The beast is in. Racing. Aregia started in last. Smart Prospector started in first and is very, very fast. Number four is off to the early lead. I like that. I like it because it's a short race. My heart's starting to beat fast. Finish round! Finish round! Today for the mayor, Aregia. It is Smart Prospector unleashed the beast. I think we might have got lost at the end. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was a close finish. I don't know. Oh, I think it could have been by a nose. I don't know. Very tight photo finish in race number four. Stand by. I think my guy got him by a nose. I think my guy got him by a nose. They're taking a look at the tickets. Right now, he's at a uh, 10 to 1. I might have gotten it. Four smart. Yes! We won! We won! It's science, people. It's science. Second. Oh, by a nose. I don't know, people. I don't know how I do it. It's so easy. It's so easy. It's science, people. Producer Ted. Six, Producer Ted joins us now with seven, his winnings, everybody. Eight. That's right. How much did you win? I won $34 on that race. Nice. Yeah. Look at that. Now, yeah. uh, was that your only uh, was that your only win of the day? That was the that so that was the first race of the day. Okay. My only win of the day. And what happens after you win is I usually leave after I win, but since it was the first race, you gotta stay. Yeah. So then you get a little greedy and you start making bets that you shouldn't be making. Uh, you know, so I, the next race I did a superfecto, which is one, two, three, four, which if you get that right, you're not coming into work the next day. Yeah, okay. So obviously I lost. And that. what's it called again? Superfecta. That's superfecta. Four, four in a row. Okay, now we have video of Ted losing right here. This is, uh, this is Ted losing the superfecta. And this is me telling people, stop while you're ahead. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I did, not to rub it in. When I won on the Miranda on the Sex and the City machine, I got up and walked away. I did, you, yeah. You, you have. That's half the battle, knowing when to just say, that's enough. Well, let's have a, a teaching time with Ted. If people are watching and they've never been, and I've told you this before, I've never gone, yeah. I've never gone to the track. It, maybe they're nervous. It's like picking a bottle of wine. You don't, you're overwhelmed. What should they do? Do they help them at Canterbury? Yeah, yeah. So you can don't try to do those little machines to to make your bets because you're just you, you're guessing. Yeah, 
Um, you know, go, go up to the ticket booth, uh, I would say 10, 15 minutes before the race. If you go like five minutes before the race and you're asking all these questions, people behind you are going to get really annoyed yeah. because the, the clock is ticking and you've got to get your bet in. So fi 10, 15 minutes beforehand, you can ask all the questions you want. They'll be very helpful. And you'll, you'll be able to make your wager. Don't do, you know, a lot of people do place or show. So you're basically thinking, oh, my horse is going to finish in the top three. Great, you won, but you also just won 10 cents. Yeah, don't do that. No, go for the big bucks. Go for the big bucks like Ted did. That's right. Give it up for Ted, everybody. you got to take me. I've never... We, we did a story there, but I've never gone. I would, I would like to... should come. Jason Show meeting. That's right. Jason Show meeting. We'll be posting... All of these best things ever on our Facebook page and YouTube page. You can also stay connected with us by finding Jason Show TV on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.